I'm a big Hollywood buff. We are in a special place called Hollywood, right? Hollywood is essential for movies. We're in Hollywood. That's right, we're talking about the noir. We are in Hollywood, Florida, Cafe Noir. Here's looking at you, kid. Yeah. South Florida has always been that spot where we as kosher keeping communities would roll down in vacation. South Florida has become a lot more than that. It's become a more come down and stay spot. And because of those demographics, we're seeing so much change just in the kosher all the way around. And one of those things that I'm loving about Florida is the Tel Aviv aesthetic. The outside, beautiful weather, party all night, cafe. Cafe Noir is all of that plus it is a full menu executed well, done with a little bit of higher class, a little bit of Israeli touch, and a whole lot of that late night muchacho bravado. We're gonna start with some arancini. Arancini is a fried rice ball. So it is rice and there's a beautiful cheese inside, and a sauce, and that classic like panko-y arancini crust. When you take risotto and you put it into a ball and then you fry it, you get such a beautiful creamy from the rice itself, a crunchy texture. But they have a really nice like mozz in the middle mm -hmm. that's providing a very pleasant cheesy contrast. Uh, the pizza, you got to try my pizza. We'll try the pizza, everybody's got the pizza. They have so many great things here. Yeah. We are gonna try the pizza. Oh nice, you're gonna cut a slice in half? For you. Thank you, this is, this is fresh mozz. This is a Milano. Tomato, Milano? Yeah. This is the Alyssa pizza? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. You can hang on my wall anytime. It's a real doughy, watery, doughy crust, and you can taste the flavor in the crust. The sauce, fantastic. The cheese has a, a perfect amount of salt, and there is basil and tomato just to provide the rest of that out. But honestly, for a late night, like, house of drunk pizza because I'm in Hollywood, yeah, hitting the spot so hard. I know it sounds crazy, but Judd really loves pasta shapes, right? Yeah. You do. You're very excited about different types of pastas. Yes. The role of pasta shapes is important, and it also plays into the sauce, because there's a starch that's going to be exuded, and then the sauce is going to stick. So this is called a? Papardelle truffle. Papardelle is fantastic because it's wide. It clings to extra sauce, and then really, Papardelle has the best kind of chew. The most important aspect here is that sauce is clinging so nicely to that pasta. And as you chew, there's a multi-pasta layer effect akin to almost like a lasagna. Kachapuri, we know what a kachapuri is already. Oh, yeah. Because in five, six years, it's gotten all over the place. Kachapuri is a, is a holy blend of a salty, funky mozzarella. So usually it's, usually it's fed on mozz. And then you drop butter, and then you drop the egg, and then you you mix it all together. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna make a mess, gonna make a mess. Just keep it in. The idea that you have this great crunchy doughy pizza dough, and all of a sudden you have this incredibly milky, creamy, cheesy, salty, is why you need to experience a kachapuri. Oh yeah. These are ba 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 buns. We've started seeing bao buns a lot of places. Bao buns are a beautifully steamed, risen sandwich vehicle. It's a soft and fluffy, and the texture's what it's all about. A bao is beautiful, and what they're doing here is a salmon shawarma bao bun. Shawarma is a sum of its parts. It's got all those things in there, the spices, the necessaries, and very at the end, you know you're eating salmon. The bao bun is such a beautiful texture. Imagine if you had the fluffiest, fluffiest donut lava. We started with this kind of noirish mystery. What is it all about? The menu is incredible for what we've seen in the gross of kosher community, especially here in Hollywood. Hollywood is not a place that you come to visit anymore. Hollywood's a place you come to move to. Mm. And with that, we're seeing great kosher happen, and the mystery today has been solved, because the great kosher that's happening is also happening at Cafe Noir, Hollywood, Florida. With my brains and your looks, we can go places, baby.
Oh, 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 oh,